Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Scourge Hive. I'm Cog Dissident, and uh, I'm trying to kill all three of these enemies at once. And hey, it worked. So, ah, I'm probably gonna have to kill all of these guys before I can uh, move on. Whoa! Don't hit them with fire. Right. Yep. That little ball thingy keeps chasing me. But hey, we've got six keys. So now we can go through. Huh, there's two red dots in this room. I wonder what those signify. Death by spider? Maybe. Yep, I like how the shots chain the nearby guys. Makes taking out hordes so much easier. Oh, those are pits. I see. How oh, you get up there? That I don't see. Okay. Huh. Okay. Well, there's a pit. Where does the pit go? Goes underground. Well, that kind of expected, actually. Oh, a pit that goes underground. Well, now I'm surprised. Anyway, so yeah, still looking at what I want to do for my next let's play. I'm thinking of doing uh, Life Force because I'm great at that game. I think if I remember right. I might even be able to do it without, you know, the 30 lives combo which would be amazing. But, you know, maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. Somebody suggest something better to me. Oh. Huh. Look at that. So we have to run this way. I see. Before we all die from the little timer thing again. Yeah, we're pretty close to a med bay, so I'm not going to worry too much about it. Electricity, because electricity is safe to use on the bugs. Although it doesn't kill them very quickly. Yep. I think we're about at the point where we really can't die, assuming we actually fight the opponents. We, we just don't die to them anymore, because we have just that much life. I don't know what those things do. We'll find out. Hey, a med bay. Woo, med bay. And we're set back to zero. Let me see. There's only one exit from here. Yep. Well, at least we didn't miss anything. Hey, there's a key in this room. See what I said about weapon switching before? Yes, the game loves weapon switching with a passion. Oh, this room is huge. Which way to go? Which way to go? Ah, uh, stop. Huh. Okay. Door is open. Door goes here. Well, you know, at least the door is open, right? Now, we don't need to go down there anymore. So we go this way. And more keys. Ah. Get away. Notice how we don't use the freezy gun, like, at all in this section? Yeah, I think they just wanted it to be the one gimmick of that area. And then to never, ever, ever use it again. I wonder if we can freeze these guys. Let's try. Nope. 
doesn't even do anything. Good to know. Oh, there's a door that requires three keys, which we don't have. Let's not go that way. Not yet. Go away. Go, 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 go. Huh. Well, I guess we can die, because some of the areas of the damage ramped up way high. Yep. Hey! Second key. Now we just need to beat up this guy. Which way to go? This way? That's weird. Okay. Disruptor bolt him. Disruptor bolt bad guy. Oh, a security alert, which we'll read after we successfully kill all these and not die. I have no idea when I started this video, but this doesn't seem like uh, seven minutes, which is my new recording limit because I'm trying to do this in good quality. To anyone who chances upon this, I'm sorry ha for having failed my friends and colleagues. My suit's infection containment has failed and it won't be long before the infection takes hold. Taking the research data as far as it could from the source's reach, the source, ooh bug name for the infection. And made it as far as Jormung's cage. I took to the other team. Started to start hanging back. See if I could destroy it or damage the world tree. Yggdrasil. Hmm. Experimental adrenaline rush upgrade. Placed it in security lock. Well, that's got to be somewhere. How about let's uh, save this, and I will actually get a uh, egg timer this time, so I know how long the freaking video is. Anyway, this has been a probably very short Let's Play Scourge Hive. See you next time.